my name is Tyler Driscoll. I'm a junior at Arizona State University. I'm studying business entrepreneurship and minoring in real estate. I'm Daniela Pando. I am going to the University of Arizona as a freshman and I'm studying physiology and medical sciences. I'm Coy Wagley and I'm going to be a freshman at New Mexico State University and my plan is to get a degree in general agriculture and a minor in ag business. My name is Sydney White. I'm a sophomore at the University of Arizona and I'm currently studying architectural engineering. My name is Ty Wagley. I am currently a sophomore at NMSU University. I am getting a degree in agronomy and a minor in horticulture. Once I'm graduated, I plan on obtaining my real estate license and then working in the commercial agricultural industry for about five years, give or take a little bit. And then um, I want to move to the Navajo Reservation, live and work there for four to five years. And then by the time I'm 30, I'll be eligible to run for Navajo Nation president. And then once I'm about 35, uh, I want to be close to retirement at that time. Right now, I'll finish undergrad with my bachelor's, and then I plan on attending medical school to then become a pediatrician. And eventually, I want to come back to Wilcox because I've always noticed like we're very medically underrepresented, and I love this community and what it does, what it did for me, and how it raised me. So I just want to come back and give back by either helping out at the hospital or coming back and opening my own pediatric clinic. After I graduate from college, uh, my plans to, as of the moment, is to move back here and run our family farm and uh, my two brothers, uh, where then I buy more land and that way we can have another set of income to help uh, increase the ag business and ag industry in our little part of the world. After I graduate, I want to go and work for a design firm either in Tucson or Hawaii right now. I'm looking into um, climate analysis. I'm really interested in that. So more of like the analytics and the engineering behind architecture. So that's what I'm looking to go into after I graduate. After I graduate, uh, like Coy said, we're going to come back to the farm. I think that's all of our plans is to come back and just develop our family farm, make it bigger, make it more productive. Uh, with my degree, I also have the capability of being a farm advisor around the county and into Arizona. Uh, for being an agronomist, that's a big thing. And so that's what I plan to do with it and hopefully help not only our farm, but surrounding farms in the area. I feel at scholarships, there's the value is it outweighs the dollar amount in the amount of time that you can spend being a college student and not having to work or pay your own way through school. It allows you to have the full experience of being a college student. You know, you instead of working, you know, 20 to 30 hours a week, a part-time job, you can spend 20 to 30 hours a week being in a in a club or a, a, an organization. You know, like I'm on the ASU Gun Devil, the shotgun shooting team and we just got back from the national college shoot in San Antonio. The scholarships allow me to have that time to do these things just because it frees up the time in my week and my day. Obviously we all know that college is expensive. However, I've really noticed that this past year um, not being stressed about the money aspect of school has really allowed me to fully focus in my studies because I do have to get good grades to be able to go further in my career. And this scholarship has just really helped me alleviate that financial stress and really focus on my goals in an educational aspect. To help me with motivation to do all my schoolwork even more and it has me striving for something to keep those scholarships to help me pursue my goals. Well, I'm super grateful for the scholarship, not only because it allows me to attend the university, but it allows me to focus on my studies. You know, I see people working eight hour shifts a day while they're studying, but I know in my major that I don't have time to do that. So this helps me to focus on that and then to build my individual skills in engineering and mathematics, which honestly takes a lot of time to do. So that's what it allows me and it helps me to do having this scholarship. It keeps me focused on my grades. I don't have to worry about going and getting a job so I have to pay for school. I can focus on my schoolwork and what I'm doing 
inside of school and not paying bills and whatnot. So the scholarships really help in that aspect. 